everyone, it's Kari, the Little Missouri Mama, and today I thought that I would do a brand new tag. I just heard about it in one of my Facebook groups. It was made up by Dubai Expat Mummy, or Catherine, and she tagged me to do it. So, I guess, here I go. If you see me looking down, obviously it's because I've got my phone. The questions are on there. So, how long have you been vlogging? I have been vlogging since July of this year, so it's been about it's been about three months, and I've really, really enjoyed it. Are you where you thought you would be by now? Yes <laughs> and no, but not in a bad way. I knew that I would still be vlogging and filming videos, but I didn't think I would get as many followers as I have. So that's pretty cool for me. So kind of a yes and no situation, but not no in a bad way. What motivated you to start your channel? Honestly, my son is getting older. This was in July. This was right before he started kindergarten. And I kind of want almost like a digital scrapbook, I guess, would be the best way to say it, of our life together, stuff that we do, things that maybe... I won't remember in a few years because you know memories are weird things and who knows maybe in a couple years the memories of going to the pumpkin patch are going to be just completely gone and replaced with something else and that's fine but I want to still have those memories so it's kind of a digital scrapbook also admittedly I'm a stay-at-home mom I would like to possibly help bring in some income if I can, but right now I'm not even really thinking about that. I am nowhere near large enough. I don't even have a thousand views on all of my videos, so, you know. But in the future, I mean, that's kind of where I'm thinking about heading with this. What was the first video you ever shot, and do you cringe now when you watch it? Be honest. The first video I ever shot on this channel was my intro and not really um the only reason i would cringe is because it's super shaky i have ms and i have tremors in my hands so getting a camera and getting a tripod was one of the best things i could have done now that being said i don't like watching myself in videos anyway no matter what i just i think i sound weird and i don't know so I kind of cringe anyway, so I'm not really a good person to ask that to. <laughs> What's been your biggest wow moment so far? It's only been three months, so I don't think I really have a big wow moment yet. Um, ask, me, ask me this again in a year. Who are your favorite mommy vloggers? Um, Amanda Ray, of course. I like Being Mommy with Style, The Bellin Family, Andrea Mills, and I think those are really my top four. If you could collab with any mommy vlogger, who would it be and why? Um, well, my son wants me to say Being Mommy with Style. <laughs> he is absolutely in love with her. When we originally started watching her, she was moving from our area, and he was seeing a lot of places that he recognized because I actually worked down pretty close to where she lived, I think. And so he would recognize places. He recognized the mall. He recognized the little sandwich shop that they went to. It was just a lot of fun for him to be able to see and kind of recognize, oh, I know that place. I know that place. And to be honest with you, I think he's got a crush on Bella. <laughs> he likes older girls with dark hair. So I, I think he really likes Bella. And I think that from what I can see temperament wise, I think he and Natalie would be really, really good friends and they're about the same age too. So that's terrifying. Um, if I could do a collab with her, I think that would be awesome too. <laughs> Honestly, I think Di is just a really funny and sweet and relatable person. So I think, I think she would be a lot of fun to collab with. On a realistic note, I'm not sure. I've never done a collaboration. I've never reached out to anyone. I've never had anyone reach out to me. I don't feel that I'm big enough yet to do collaborations and really have it benefit either me or the person who is collaborating. So I figure when I get up to about 140, 150 subscribers, I'll start looking into doing collaborations. Number eight, what has been the best thing about setting up your channel so far? 
honestly, I like the marketing. I like the channel art. I like making my thumbnails and making everything match and coordinate. I like putting my videos out there and having to do up little ads and things like that. I just, I think it's <laughs> I like the marketing aspect. So, number nine and the worst. After all that, I'm not a people person. <laughs> I don't know how to connect with people. I'm always afraid that I'm coming off awkwardly or being annoying. So I try to let other people kind of connect with me first. I'm sure I come off as snobby and I really don't mean to be. I like the marketing aspect, but I'm just so afraid of looking awkward and so afraid of being annoying to people. If you comment on my videos or you talk to me and I kind of come off as shy or guarded, I'm not. <laughs> I just don't want to be annoying. <laughs> so I apologize so much for that. And number 10, do you have any regrets? Oh boy, where do I begin? <laughs> oh wait, you mean YouTube. Okay. <laughs> do I have any YouTube regrets? Not really. I guess maybe not starting this earlier. My son is five and I think it would have been fun to do this as he got older and kind of watch him grow up on camera, but he's still young enough that I think I'll be able to do that. And he's now starting to develop his own personality and it'll be fun to see how it changes as he goes through school. So I really don't have that many regrets. Anyway, for the mummy tag, the mummy vlogger tag, I tag Amanda Ray, of course. Um, I tag being mommy with style if she wants to do it. <laughs> I know she hasn't been able to do a lot of the daily vlogs. Maybe this could be something kind of fun. I don't know. Hi. <laughs> Remember that annoying thing? This is me worrying about being annoying. So, I guess I'll tag anyone else who wants to do it. So, if you do do it, let me know in the comments below. Let me know that you've done this somehow and I will definitely check it out and I'll make sure to comment and I'll probably annoy the heck out of you because I just won't leave you alone. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. If you like what you see make sure to subscribe. Don't forget if you want to you can drop a comment down below or you can hit me up on Instagram at Little Missouri Mama or on my Twitter at Little Missouri Mom or on my blog littlemissourimama.wordpress.com the links to which are all in the description box down below and as always, have a good one. Bye.